Look at this one. Oh, it's huge. It's not meant for you to sit on. Oh, it's not? No, it's meant for you to like use as like decor. 17 year old son is like, dad. Bouquets. It's no. like a, a shish kebab of color. No. No, 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 no. Thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring today's video. Hello and welcome to the house of Valentina. I'm Valentina and my husband Jack and I, we've been up to a little bit of mischief in the last couple days. <laughs> yes, we have. As we promised you in our last spring decor mistake video, we immediately went afterwards and shopped at Target. And we want to be able to share all of our great finds with you. Not only did we find lots of things at the store, but we also found all kinds of things that we wanted to bring home. So we're going to take you to the store, show you what to be on the lookout for, and then we'll bring you back here in just a bit and share everything that we bought. We hope that sounds like tons of fun. Make sure you hit subscribe and give the video a big thumbs up and meet us back here in just a bit. See you then. <laughs> we are headed into Target to do some spring shopping and I've got Jack and my Parker with me today. They are definitely gonna be helping me spend my money and see what we can find to get the house ready for spring. And I cannot wait. I just have this feeling that there's gonna be so many fun things and we're gonna be sharing all of our finds with you. So uh, let's go. Literally the one place that never gets old. <laughs> Still get excited every single time. Target! Ah. <laughs> you know it's trouble. Can't go to Target without a cart. Not that one. Not that one. <laughs> Very picky, huh? That one's had a rough day. Oh boy. All right, let's go see what we can find. We've got spring everywhere. This is so exciting. I should check the dollar section too. Okay. But let's, ooh, look at all the new fragrances. What do they got? Rose water and mint. Little wipes. Focus. Ooh, you would like this. Spearmint and orange. Ooh. And they have the little candles. I think I'd rather have a candle from the back though. Let's go check out what they have in the what back. Do you mean? Oh, from the back. From like the decor section. Okay. No. Well, it doesn't like either one. Yeah, okay, <laughs> let's go to the back. Look at all the spring colors. It's like the whole entire store is like so colorful and bright. We are headed back to the outdoor section. I cannot wait. We haven't even gotten very far and look at these baskets. These are gorgeous. I love these. These look great. The boys have already ditched me, <laughs> which means I'll have to go find them when I want to put some of these in the basket. But I love how they've got that little pattern in them and they are $10. They've got the round and they have the rectangular. So these are really, really cute. And I spotted over here some cute ones if you have kids. Those are super cute. I want to stop and take just a moment to thank our video sponsor for today, which is Squarespace. Squarespace truly is a one-stop destination for creating your online presence. We absolutely love Squarespace. We love how easy it is to use. And we also love the fact that there's great templates that help you create something that's really beautiful. We've been using Squarespace for years and absolutely love it. You can go to houseofvalentina.com if you want to see a Squarespace site and just be able to check out all the different possibilities because we've been using it for a blog, we have a portfolio, we have design pages, we've also had a shop, and it's just really great because it's really user-friendly and we've just absolutely loved being able to create that online presence that really reflects our own personal style as well. Head to squarespace.com for a free trial and when you're ready to launch, go to squarespace.com backslash House of Valentina to save 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. Thank you again to Squarespace and now let's get back to some Target shopping. Oh boy. Oh yeah, this is one that they always have and I think that's a great pattern. But I also love the dark as well. I think that looks amazing. Look at this. I don't remember seeing that before. That's part of the threshold for $20. And it's got the little, no, no, that's Opal House. Okay, so that's in the wrong spot. I think that's $36. Look at that. Look at this. This is so pretty. It's beautiful. It really has a very high-end feel to it. And they have this little basket, which could be great for toys or pet storage, all kinds of stuff. 
the store suddenly got super crowded and I was kind of trying not to get on other people into the video, but I did want to make sure to give you a proper tour of the outdoor section. It's really fun because right now Target has lots of different collections. So you've got the Studio McGee, you've got the Jungalo collection, you've got Project 62. So what's so fun is that there's a lot of variety and you can really hone into your personal style. Here you can see I am eyeing up all of the outdoor pillows. They actually have some really great neutrals. Of course, that's what I personally really am drawn to. I find that these sort of neutrals are something that you can just pull out every single year. I personally don't love to have a ton of outdoor cushions. So I feel like, you know, for $15, you can add maybe one or two to an outdoor area and it's not gonna break the bank, but it'll just add a little bit of softness. There are also a lot of outdoor faux plants and I'm not really sure what you would use those for. I think you could just use real ones. You guys let me know down in the comments what you would do. Here you can see we are checking out a lot of the tables and they've got some great options. They have this really cute metal table, although that definitely needs to go somewhere where rain will not gather in it. Take that as a lesson that I have personally learned from another table that I have. This one that looks like stone was really, really pretty and really has that sort of modern vibe that I personally really love. And the terrazzo pieces are a lot of fun as well. They really had a lot of variety, everything from this wood one to, it actually, this one actually looks like a piece of wood. And I think that's actually kind of fun. I really liked that one. You guys let me know down in the comments, which of these tables was your favorite? Next up, I headed over to the planters and they have got these concrete looking ones that I really, really liked. I love that kind of texture on them. They really have a lot of variety again, so you can really find things that suit your personality. I usually avoid the small planters because typically if you buy something really small, it's gonna be harder to keep alive. So I suggest going with some of these bigger planters and going a little bit bigger on your plants. So they're definitely a lot more likely to, to survive. When they're seedlings, they're just, yeah, they're easy to kill. So here you can see there's a lot of wicker pieces. You've got some beautiful trays. I thought this one was gorgeous. Then you've also got bowls and some outdoor accessories. I thought that these lanterns were really, really neat. They are wicker and they are solar powered. So I thought that was pretty cool. I bet they'll probably fade just a little bit in the sun, but still look amazing. I love these little kind of like brushed brass kind of looking ones. They have something very similar at Pottery Barn that I've actually ordered for my own house, but these were definitely really, really cute and I would totally buy those. These lanterns as well were really pretty and really modern. I loved these. What you're gonna find is that right now, Target is going to be hooking you up with so many things, you're gonna have a hard time deciding. I mean, look at this little lantern as well. I would put something like this on the dining table and have a little candle in it. Target also has a ton of really great neutrals. If you need to switch up the cushions, maybe on your sofa or your chairs, they have got all the neutrals in all the colors that I'm looking for. And I thought that these were really, really pretty and all the patterns were just, I thought they were great. There were a lot that I would choose personally. If you want beige, if you want navy, if you want gray, Target pretty much has it all. Next up, we have the fire pit section. And again, I was really blown away by the options that Target has. They have got some really great ones. These concrete looking ones are really cool and modern and they even have them for the tabletop if you don't want a really big one. I, I think that these look really cool and I think that they look really fun. It's something that we have in our own house and it's just really, it's just one of those experiences that you can use these to hang out if you need a little bit of warmth, but especially for s'mores making. It's just a lot of fun. It's something that we enjoy as a family as well. Next up, we have these gorgeous chairs by Studio McGee, and I thought that they were gorgeous. They really look high-end, and they do look like teak, although I don't think that they actually are, but those were really beautiful. Adding some wood or even some rattan to your outdoor area can really just help it to feel really inviting, and that's something that I'm even working on in my own space because I wanna just warm it up a little bit. This little Boda patio set, this little bench was adorable. I would totally put that in my own house. Maybe avoid some of the little plastic kind of chairs though. <laughs> this looks exactly like the set that I ordered for my patio. 
that um, is actually gonna be at my mom's house very soon because I switched up my style. I went from something that was more traditional to something that was a little bit more modern. So I'm more drawn to this style. Personally, I like something that just has a clean line, that's a little bit more modern. These chairs by Project 62 are really cool because they've got kind of like this little nylon rope on them. So I think those would actually be pretty comfy. And I personally would put a little cushion in the back. And then this little petrified wood table is really cool. You can also check out Target for your outdoor umbrellas. I personally, again, am drawn to the neutrals. I've got them in the gray and the beiges, but there are a few patterns that are also really fun if you'd rather have a pattern. You will also find that Target is going to absolutely load you up on options for outdoor rugs. There were so many, I was having a hard time trying to figure out which one I would recommend over the other. They really have a lot of great ones, whether it's a diamond pattern or one of those by Studio McGee I thought were really great. They also had some that were a little bit bolder, some that were a little bit more dramatic and modern, and yet they also had these stripes. I think it's a lot of fun to just switch up your outdoor rug. It's a really inexpensive way of getting a brand new look and these are all super affordable. And of course, I'm drawn to the black and white ones, but you, the beige and a lot of these would just look absolutely fantastic. Jack Fussell. You're nuts. It's my favorite time of the year. No, no. I told him no. You no. You said I was allowed to do. Your 17 year old son is like dad. Bouquets. It's like no. a, a shish kebab of color. No. No, 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 no. We're shopping for rugs. I try to talk him out of it. That's but the voice of reason. These are the best. You don't get the other ones. You have to get the bunnies. Because you have to eat the eyes off first. <laughs> <laughs> little... Don't tempt me. Look at that guy. He's like, what? Why is he so nice? Aww. I know. He needs, to, he needs to be loved. Wow. Some of those are looking at... Wow. This one's like... These have had some rough days. It's supply chain issues. Well, no, the rest of these look great. <laughs> these guys are like all looking off to the side. Yeah. Oh, how about you go put those back and make room for spring decor instead? <laughs> are those are those the chicks or the or the bunnies? You don't get chicks. You only get bunnies. Oh, really? Yeah, that's the way it works. Lovely. <laughs> <laughs> what? All I hear is Dad gasping making pancakes. Okay, now that's cute, because then that, you can make that healthy. Yeah, that's what I was just thinking about healthy. We don't need that though. We just pancakes. said in our last video, no chicks and bunnies, and that's all you... <laughs> Burger. All right, I'm out of here. Come on, son. Let's go look for chicks. Wow, gosh. Well, before Jack gets into too much trouble, I thought we better just go ahead and keep shopping. I love to switch up my towels in the springtime. It's just a good excuse when you're doing your spring cleaning to just give the kitchen a little refresh and get a nice set of fresh towels. These are only $13 for a big set, so it's definitely very budget friendly. I did get a little bit distracted. They had some super cute shoes and I know I was being a little bit naughty, but this little pair was very similar to the pair that I had on that I had found at Amazon. So definitely check out our Amazon lives if you want to see clothes, but I may have gone home with these little shoes, but you'll have to see to the end what we ended up with. I also love to update the outdoor rugs. I think this is a perfect time to check out your doormats and your outdoor rugs because they do tend to get kind of dingy and dirty and simple things like this can really help your entire patio area just feel really updated and fresh. I personally tend to avoid ones that have too many words on them, that are too busy. However, I do still really like this classic one that's only $25 that says welcome. I, I feel like that's okay. What do you guys think? This is the kind of stuff that typically I avoid, so I thought it might be helpful to show you what I don't buy. And I always feel so guilty, but yeah, no, I usually pass on this stuff. I still love all these baskets. This is pretty. Pretty. That is really, really pretty with that dark color like that. What about something like that, like on the table. I think something like that could be really pretty styled up on the the coffee table. Mm -hmm. Let's try to take one of these home. Okay. Uh oh. <laughs> I wasn't smiling. Take it again. <laughs> Two boys. <laughs> love you guys. 
You guys really are the best. That's cool. That's for a candle. Do you like that? Yeah. It's kind of cool, isn't it? Yeah, you want to see something absolutely beautiful? Oh, no. No, no. No, I knew where this was going. Best thing in the store. <laughs> Oh, you know what we gotta get is the candle. Whoa, look at this one. Oh, it's huge. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh. I really love this one. That smells really good. Okay, I, I really love that. Really like that is it. such a splurge. Oh my gosh. I like this Ooh, I like that. I like Do you wanna put some more blue in your bedroom for the season? Yeah. You wanna take that with us? Sure. Okay. Did you smell the salt one? You smell rattan? Do you like Ooh. the rattan? I do like the rattan. Really? Yeah. I don't think I liked that one. Oh, it was the pompous, I think, that wasn't my favorite. See this one? This one's personally made from chip gains to me. <laughs> chip, come on. <laughs> Not in front of everybody. Oh, look at the hand soaps. Oh, yeah. I like it. Are you sitting? Yeah, I can only put one cheek on at a time, but this. <laughs> It's not meant for you to sit on. Oh, it's not? No, it's What's meant for you to like use as like decor. Oh. <laughs> and you gotta face it the wrong way. Just to sit on the other side. Nope. Jeez, Jack. Sit on this way. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, Dad, sit. <laughs> right. Please, don't embarrass <laughs> us. You're gonna get us kicked out. There is my favorite vase. Aw, that's cute. I'm trying to stay focused. You are not helping. I just found it. I really like this lamp. That's actually really pretty, isn't it? That's really pretty. <laughs> you are so much like your dad. These look pretty good. But these are also really easy to grow. I do like the containers. That's actually quite pretty. All right, we are back home that and- was fun. Yeah, we had so much that fun. It was a lot of fun. Did you guys have fun too? We just had a blast. <laughs> Parker was hilarious. We had so much, we had such a good time with him. Yeah, it's just fun. I mean, to have your 17 year old go to Target with you, that's pretty cool. So, yeah. got a cup of coffee and now we're gonna chat through some of the stuff that we brought home because in addition to the uh, dress that I'm wearing, which is- Which is stunning. <laughs> Oh my I've gosh. been putting it on nonstop. I'm like, oh my gosh, it's like the perfect spring dress it's and it's gorgeous. so affordable. Thank yeah. you. Yeah, it's Thank you. So yeah, I found some uh, spring clothes and we found some home items as well. Let's talk about what we've got. Yes. So we start with this, which is an outdoor accent rug. Yeah, I'm actually planning on using that indoors. Because can you do that? <laughs> Such a it's rule just breaker. a, I know I am. No, <laughs> I found this in the outdoor section and I thought that it was so pretty. It's part of the Project 62 collection and it's just a really simple braided rug. But I, as you might be able to get little glimpses of, I've been adding some browns and some beiges into the house and I really just love just some raw materials. I'm, I'm really really enjoying this for spring. The other thing that we got was the candle that we talked about, the salt candle from yes. the Magnolia collection. Oh, it smells so good. I oh, love it, it so, so much. And I love that rustic container like that. I think that's just really, really beautiful. And do you want to like, one. I know, I here, here, we're I gonna- I can't lift this. We're, yeah. go, we're gonna do this. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we also brought home this big wooden candle and I 100% jumped the gun today because everybody was out. I don't even think you can see it, but just over there here, you know what? Let me show you the reality is right over there is a big pile of stuff. Way over there. <laughs> I took out all the wool blankets. I took oh, out some so of cool. the different lights and I'm redoing the whole room. Wait, and that's so cool because the other day you talked about lightening up the mood for spring. That yes. was on Sunday's video. Yeah. And then you guys wonder what happens afterwards. This is what happens. Mm -hmm. Like it goes there. Yep. And then it works its way down. And yeah, we've got a little storage area. We have area. a storage area and we reuse it or whatever. But still, this smells amazing. It does. The house smells like What's, What heaven. scent is that? That was the grapefruit one. And I loved the, the wood color because I've been really wanting to bring a lot more brown into the space. And this was just it, just, it smells good. It adds that brown color and it adds just a little bit of 
wood. Can you show them the basket as well? Oh, that also came from awesome. Target, you guys. I've been noticing a lot in Europe that they're starting to use a lot of the brown wicker tones, a lot of brown wood, and I absolutely love this. It took me a really long time to get around to the blonde wood. I'm having no trouble whatsoever wrapping my mind around these brown tones. I just adore them. I've even got right behind us, can you like lean? Yeah, look. I've even got Ooh. these brown pillows that I got from Amazon. I, I just, didn't even look at those. Yeah. I just came and sat down. Yeah. So those are gorgeous. Yeah, they're this incredible linen. If you are not watching our Amazon live events, you need to go check out our Amazon storefront and hit follow because these are the kinds of things that I'm showing you on our oh Amazon lives. Gosh. I cannot believe these came from Amazon. These are amazing. Guys. I thought these were, you would have said these are custom made. I know. They the are incredible everything's incredible on them. yeah and they work perfectly with this tray you can see where my mind is going yeah. so parker up in his room he was so sweet you know what when your 17 year old oh. asks for a pillow i'm like he's getting a pillow i know he actually has a lot of the brown in his room so i might use his pillow maybe in our room i'm sending jack to go grab some of the clothes because I actually grabbed a few clothing items and I thought it'd be really fun to share with you. A lot of times I don't share the clothing items and then you guys have been asking more and more for them after I did a little clothing haul on one of our Fridays with V. And so I thought I'd share with you these really cute shoes that I found at Target as well. I can't believe it. They're a six and a half and I'm usually like a six and a half, seven and these fit perfectly. So I'm super excited because they've got that little kind of basket weave. They actually look very Moroccan. We wore slippers very similar to this when we lived over in Morocco. And so it just made me really happy to have something like this. Just to slip on, even just running to the, what are you doing? I was doing a catwalk. Lovely. <laughs> are you done? <laughs> <laughs> Anywho. <laughs> These are great if you want to have them by the back door. If you, I a lot of oh, times will those. run out to the garden and this looks so good on you yesterday. Yeah, I'm I'm really excited. So just a little pair and knowing girls me, girls luck out. Girls have great shoes. You're so and you guys get like 90 pair of them, and they're so cool. You have more shoes than I do. Yes, but yeah. I don't have anything like this. These are you killer. Could buy these for men. They yeah, would but be cool. But your feet cool. are prettier. That's true. No one's denying that. <laughs> So then I also got, if you guys have noticed, I keep wearing a lot of my black tank tops that are ribbed and it's Fine. almost become a joke because I keep talking about things being ribbed and having a sort of obsession with like touching it. Yeah, yes. sorry. Sorry. Enough said. <laughs> this is $8 and it's such a great find because it does have a little bit of a wider um, strap up here, which will actually cover a bra strap because a lot of them are so narrow that I yeah. guess you're supposed to go the Europeans go braless. Valentina, not so much. <laughs> so my daughter's like, go braless. I'm like, yeah, no, honey, no. <laughs> okay, so I also got this other dress, which is gorgeous because it's got these little straps on the top, which is great because it does hide a little bra strap again. And just like the other one, it's nice and long. I'm gonna punch you in the face, sorry. <laughs> And then it's got pockets. This one has pockets too. So it's the key word apparently. Pockets. It is. If, if you wear dresses, you know what I'm talking about. There's something about those pockets. It's awesome. Okay, so then I also got these green little, they're like a, almost like a, I think they're, I think they're denim. They're like a green denim. And they are super cute. I actually went up a size and got them in a mm. two rather than a zero because I wanted them to be kind of baggy. And they've got the little belt that comes with them. That's cool. And yeah, I'll definitely be showing you guys more of this stuff in upcoming videos. But so I think that's about all that we no, got for I've got today. One more thing. <laughs> you went out to the car earlier and I was paying. So I threw one more thing in and it does break a Valentina rule, but I did put the other 600 of these back. Uh huh. Yeah. Did, did you see that part in the video? We did get some bunnies. No, you got some bunnies. I mean, the good news with these is they are gluten-free. So they are, I mean, in my mind, that's like Whole Foods. <laughs> Absolutely. Okay, so there you have it. That is our Target haul, including Jack's bunnies. The peeps. You know, these really stand out in our house. Because they're really just, <laughs> then I probably need to eat like them. The one pop of color 
If so, I get rid of them, then you won't see them anymore. That's true. So thank you so much for joining us. I hope that you got some ideas and some inspiration out of the video. We'll be linking up all of our favorites down in the description box, but also make sure that you hit subscribe if you haven't already because we're about to hit 300,000 subscribers. Yeah. I can't believe it. That's crazy. Yeah, so make sure you hit subscribe because I also don't want you to miss out. We're gonna do a full tour of this room because somebody is gonna be taking some stuff down and we're gonna be organizing and redoing yeah. the whole space. Can't wait to share that. Anytime there's stuff by the door, that means exciting things are happening. <laughs> yes. So you definitely wanna be a part of that and watch and see what's coming. Yes, so thank you again. And uh, you don't have a coffee. Nope. Have but you peep. got peeps. So we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Bye. <laughs> it's like my dream. If I could drink those, I would. Mm. Thank you.